This is your Oregon for Bernie update for March 31st. My name is Larry Taylor, and I'm the uh, central coordinator for Oregon for Bernie. Uh, what's been happening? So the, we have an update on the events happening last week. Uh, Joe Biden had zero events in Oregon. Beto O'Rourke had zero events in Oregon. Elizabeth Warren had zero events in Oregon. Kamala Harris had zero events in Oregon. Cory Booker had zero events in Oregon, but Bernie Sanders had two and we'll be sharing information on those today. The first event was in Lane County. The Burnstorm Lane County event really knocked it out of the ballpark. It was at World Pies in Eugene. Uh, going on to the slides, the first slide shows the ex exterior of World Pies and one of the organizers. Uh, the next slide is shows you the room that they uh, where they had set up. They had a number of groups tabling. They had uh, stuff for sale. Uh, it went on for three hours from two o'clock to five. Uh, next slide shows Lane County Commissioner Joe Burney, who uh, also spoke. So it's great to see elected officials coming out besides just Jeff Merkley, uh, who came out last time. Uh, next slide shows Joe speaking. So he spoke to the group. Uh, next slide is our awesome Carol Scherer, who uh, was uh, was uh, recorded in the six o'clock news. So she got to uh, speak about the event uh, 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 to the public. Next slide shows uh, some of the entertainment that was going on in the afternoon. Next slide shows our own James Barber speaking to the group. Uh, James was a, a delegate for the Bernie Sanders in 2016. Uh, next slide shows some of the swag that's being sold uh, for Bernie Sanders. Next slide shows some of the tabling that went on. This is the Occupy Medicare group. They had all kinds of groups that were sharing information about uh, stuff going on. Uh, next slide uh, shows one of their speakers. Uh, next slide is the Our Revolution Lane County group tabling. Uh, the next slide shows more tabling. So there's our um, uh, some of our supporters. And one that I really love about this group is that it's it's all ages, so it's, it's it's the whole spectrum there. It's like everyone is supporting Bernie Sanders. It's just not one group. And then the final slide is the uh, Feel the Burn Barn uh, that uh, this slide was created for. Great event, set a very high bar for the rest of the groups to follow. Uh, the next update is from Bert Guptal and Marcia Stewart in Albany. So the next slide shows uh, them out uh, on the streets and what they were doing was honk if you support Bernie and then tabling, uh, taking piece, people's information. Uh, uh, the last, the bottom of the slide is a quote from Marsha saying, headed home, but my God, it only takes a few of us doing little things to make a difference. How true that is. Uh, and then the next slide is Bert uh, showing one of the passersby who uh, uh, signed up. So those are the two big events that happened last week. Lots of stuff being planned for the coming months. Uh, the next slide, uh, the Multnomah Hub is meeting a week from today at the Lucky Lab in Portland. This is Bernie PDX and former delegates and actually anyone else who wants to get involved with leaders, the leadership uh, in the Portland metro area. So please go by and uh, join in the fun. They'll, they'll be at the Lucky Lab from one until three. Uh, we have Bernie swag, uh, starting to become available. Uh, the first uh, group that we're going to talk about today is Two Chicks Conspiracy. What they've, they, uh, they made the awesome shirts for uh, Bernie stock two years uh, in 2016. Uh, they've now developed a, a Bernie 2020 sh shirt, which is the black one you see on the right. And then the one in the middle, in the middle is uh, their Bernie bro shirt. Um, they just got their online sales working. So you can buy them online at www.twochicksconspiracy.com. And finally, we have bumper stickers coming. Uh, they're being designed by uh, uh, Ashley Terry now. We hope to have them produced in time for the next statewide event, which we will be announcing here. We need your help. Uh, so <clears throat> uh, we are examining ways to reform the National Democratic Party. Uh, there are things that that many of you would like to change about the party, and the way to do that is to address them in the bylaws and the and the governing documents. We need to know what your thoughts are about what to be changed, what needs to be changed. So, if you would go to advancementofdemocracy.org, 
In the middle of the home page um, is uh, a section that looks like this, uh, reform the National Democratic Party. All you do is you click on the button that says submit your ideas here and share them with those. And what we will do is take them and figure out how to translate them into bylaws changes. And by we, I mean uh, us working with delegates from Washington and California. We're forming a blue wall on the West Coast uh, and we'll be taking these forward. Uh, final slide, get involved. So there are some groups around the state that are just getting started. If you sign up, we will get you connected with them. Uh, we have the Southern Oregon group that is Jackson County and Josephine County uh, just getting organized. The Lynn Benton County is um, uh, starting to uh, plan events. Uh, we still need representation from Washington County. So if you are a Washington County burner and would like to step up and provide leadership for activities there, please sign up and we would love to have you involved. We finally found three people from Deschutes County to, that are gonna start organizing and we should be hearing some plans from them coming out shortly. You sign up at OregonForBernie.org, uh, join, the, join the team button on the contacts page if you would like to be part of the leadership. And finally, uh, Uphill Media can do lots of stuff if, you, if we had the financial resources to do so, we would love to have your, your small level donations at donate.uphillmedia.org. Thank you and see you next week.